Yeah, hi everyone. <laughs> Today I'm gonna react to a uh, SML movie, Brooklyn Guy's Big Fight. And uh apparently the room the room in here is pretty dim because it's currently raining out there. So that's why I have my Moto G light on so you can so it can reflect my face as I would make a reaction video out of this. So so, looks like Brooklyn guy is gonna fight. He's gotta fight. I wonder who it's against. So, uh, I can't say it's Brooklyn guy time, not just yet. And on that note, let's begin. Can't stress that enough, by the way. Oh no, Jeffy's putting tape on the couch again. Oh no, Jeffy! Wait, so this ain't the first it. time he's done that? Jeffy, stop putting tape on the couch. Stop it. Here, Jeffy, go get it. Go get it. <laughs> Wait, you think he's a cat or something? Get the laser. Make him go out of the room. Okay. What is he doing? Go get it, Jeffy. Go get it. Go get it. Go get it. <laughs> what are you training him like a cat for? Baby, keep playing with Jeffy. I'm answering the door. Hello? Hey, it's Brooklyn Martin, guy time. I, I just need someone to talk to. Yeah, sure, buddy. Thank you. Hey, dang. Oh, my God. The laser pointer died, Marvin. And I ran out of tape. Can you go in the store and buy me some more? Get out Heck of here, no. Jeffy. Oh, there's tape all over the couch, baby. You're supposed to hide the tape. I did, Marvin, but he found it. He always finds it. Where'd you put it, and how do you find my it? My son likes to put tape on the couch. Listen, what do you want to talk about? Well, I was on my way to my 27-year high school reunion, but then I found out that my high school bully's gonna be there, so now I don't want to go. Why do high you have a 27-year high school reunion? Oh, well, after the 25th year, people start dying, so they just do it every year. It's pretty sad. Oh, well, well you that's said your sad, high school man. bully's gonna be there? Yeah, Candy Randy. Candy, Candy Randy. Randy. Yeah, let me tell you the story. So back and in high school, there was this kid named Randy story. that everybody called Candy Randy because he would sell candy to everybody in the school. Now, for some reason, Randy didn't like me. I can't imagine why. But usually, he would only charge a dollar for his candy. But then one day, a couple hours before lunch, I was hungry and I had a dollar burning a hole in my pocket. So I went up to Randy and I was like, "Hey, Randy, let me get some Skittles." And he said, "For you, that'll be two dollars." And I said, "Randy, wow, two dollars?" Because usually, you only charge one dollar, and I only have one dollar. But he still wouldn't sell me the Skittles. So I did what wow. any man would candy do. Candy Randy's and a big joke. Ew, like what? Oh, and Randy what? Didn't like that at all. He was pissed off and he stood up and said, "Okay, meet me after." school by the flagpole and me and you are gonna fight and then oh. all the students and all the teachers went Ooh. Ooh. so i pretty much had to do it at that point so then no, i spent the whole rest of my day trying to figure out how i could fake my own death so i didn't have to fight randy i even tried to call my mom and see if she would check me out of school but she wouldn't do it she's so a then, jerk after school i went up to the flagpole and there was this huge crowd of people gathered around and they were all chanting randy randy and i was like that's not fair i can fight randy I sounds like randy is the popular is one i can take him so then I started throwing haymakers. And Randy <laughs> just kept dodging them. And then Randy started beating the shit out of me. I mean, he, he was yep. good. And then the worst part is his hands were still sticky from eating all that candy. And then after he got done beating me up, he took my underwear and tied it to the flagpole. And then he hoisted my underwear up like a flag. Is that dumb thing? Is that mark in it, so that was <laughs> And then everybody started saying the Pledge of Allegiance to my underwear. I've never been so embarrassed in all my life. I'm sorry. So that's the story. That's not funny. Well, I didn't that's mean dumb. to laugh. There's no way all your classmates are going to remember that 20 seven years later oh believe me they're oh, gonna remember the that's skid not mark. funny it was huge i practically shit my pants you didn't wipe you, that day you did have you ever tried to wipe your ass with toilet paper in a school it's like trying to wipe your ass with taco bell napkins they're all rough and they're thin i'd rather not even wipe which is why i didn't but my ass was itching a lot though I yeah, that was gross. To to That's why I don't use oh, look, public bathrooms. Going, okay? I, I spent $150 to rent this suit for the night, and I don't want it to go to waste. So I was just wondering if you guys wanted to go to, like, Red Lobster. Maybe if we're feeling classy, we could try going to Applebee's. I mean, I really want to go to Outback, but there's no way I can reserve a table this late. No, not with their blooming onions. Did you say candy, Randy? Yeah, do you know him? Mm -hmm. Yeah, there was a guy at the gas station named Randy who sold candy. Wait, what do you look like? Wait. Did you look like an asshole? No, he had cornrows and tattoos. Yep, that's, that's him. him. That's, that's that Candy. Candy Randy. You know him? Yeah, he sold me candy for a dollar. <laughs> wow. A dollar for you? Why did it have to be two dollars for me, Randy? Why? Well, listen, Who the heck gotta knows? Get over this Randy guy. So I think you should go to your high school reunion, go up to him with a dollar, and try to buy some candy. Maybe he'll like you now, and you can get over all this stuff. So it's not a year old growing up. I guess you're right. I mean, it has been 27 years. Maybe he's cool now. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna go, and I'll come back and tell you guys how it went. 
Oh, oh my god, what happened to him? Randy was selling candy for a dollar, so I tried to give him a dollar, and then he punched me in the face, and he took my dollar, and then he pulled my underwear out, and there were still skid marks on it, and then he started waving my underwear around, and everybody started laughing and calling me skid mark guy and poop clean guy, and that's not even... Oh my oh. god, yeah, why? I can't believe he still remembers guy. him. Well, we dated like ten years ago. You dated a kid what? at a gas station? What? He, she oh, dated God. him? Is he hot? Hell no. Well, why would you date a guy who sells candy at a gas station? I want to see him. Call him over. Are you sure? She yeah, dated Candy him. Randy? Okay, I think I still have his number. Let me get my yearbook. What the okay, f- Okay, here's my yearbook. Oh, oh my God. signed it? Oh, no. She signed that after we were already married because she thought it'd be cute. She didn't even go to the same school as me. Wait, who's Bake ZD Feedy Peedy? Okay, look, Who I don't have time to explain all- What kind of name is that? Okay, but I'll explain that one. See, I went to high school with this oh. guy named Petey, and we all called him Big ZD Petey because he always brought Big ZD to lunch and ate it. But then he went on a ski trip, and he got frostbite on both his feet, so he had to heat him up by putting his feet in pans of Big ZD and walking around. So we started calling him Big ZD Petey Petey. <laughs> Big ZD Petey Petey. Yeah, they are. <laughs> so, right, so weird. Look, there's Candy Randy's number. I still can't believe you P.S. I guy. hate you. Who sold candy at a That's what it says. It was forever ago. Forever ago, it's 27 I years. Have a word with him. Okay, let me go get my phone. Go confront him. Okay, I called him and there he is. Oh, hey, what's going on, Dookie Pants? Don't call me that in front of my friends. You ain't got no friends. Yes, <laughs> Why does he sound right like that? Oh, shit, is that Rosebud? Hey, is... Randy. Hey, you trying to get another taste of this pizza's eat? No, Randy, I'm married <laughs> now. Oh, that's a shame, because you just want to go and take it to the white chocolate factory. You trying to see my Willy Wonka? Randy, meet my husband, Marvin. Ex-husband. Marvin! So you on the market? I'm trying to see where these little piggies are. Well, he wants a divorce her already? Wee, 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 and all the way back to my place. <laughs> no, Randy, I'm married. Well, he's the one lucky man. Because I remember when you used to li 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 lick me like a lollipop. You know, like that little Wayne song? <laughs> little, I know, yeah. You know yeah. that song, old man? Yeah, I know that song. What did you see in him? Well, I can tell you what she didn't see. A 401k or a high credit score. But what she did see was 7.3 inches below the waist on a Oh, my God. Day. And every day was a good day. Okay, you know what? I think we should <laughs> talk about why we invited you over here. Oh, my bad. I was just reminiscing how I used to make her my Cadbury cream egg. You know what a Cadbury cream egg is? I love the way he sounds, by the way. It's too funny. So Brooklyn guy wants to call you over here because he wants to fight you. Well, I didn't say that. Oh, so he's trying to get his ass beat. Well, no, no. He wants a professional fight in a boxing ring tonight. Well, no, no, in a I boxing ring? Okay, well, you're wrong. Well, you better stop training. I'll see you tonight. What, Marvin, why would you do that? Because you need to fight him. You need to get revenge. Listen, you need a professional fight that you actually train for so you can beat him up. But I already have a black guy. He's going to kick my ass. Well, look, we're gonna He's going to murder him. Montage. We're going to fix your eye up. And you're gonna yeah, give fight. him his okay. eye back. Oh yeah, there's that training montage. <laughs> oh Marvin, I am so ready. I am ready to cheat. But cheat? Cheat? Okay, there's no way I'm gonna fight Randy fairly. He'd kick my ass. I don't think hitting punching bags for twenty seconds is gonna help me fight. Twenty seconds? Gonna cheat? So it was like a a twenty five second training montage or something? Poison? Glasses. See, what I'm going to do is I'm going to challenge Randy to a friendly water drinking competition. See, Randy is very competitive, so there's no way he's going to say no. So I'm just he's going to poison him? Glasses here, and then I'm going to take my poison and put it in Randy's glass. <laughs> he's never going to know. <laughs> okay, I'm going to call Randy. Okay, I'm going to keep stirring this so that it dissolves. Okay, I called him and there he is. Hey, 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 what's going on, Dookie Pants? I don't even care that you called me Dookie Pants. Okay, so what are we doing? Well, I thought before our fight we should hydrate. So I challenge you to a competition to see who can take the fastest sip of water. Okay, I'll do that. Water's good for your body. Okay, one, two, three, go. There's going to be a mistake. <laughs> oh, man, Randy, it looks like you won. Yeah, because you're too slow. You better be fast in the fight. <laughs> Marvin, he's so stupid. What he didn't he know. the poison. <laughs> uh. <laughs> what the fuck? You no. Switch the the... You didn't switch the cops. You never told me to switch the cops. God damn it, I thought you said you were going to switch the cops. No, wow, the Marvin cops. done messed I, I up. We should switch the cops, but you the, had the cup of poison in front of you. The poison the water was on the right. You couldn't have so switched that. God damn it, I can't move. I can't fight now. Well, you still have to fight. We can't back out. 
He's paralyzed. Yeah, that's we, completely we stupid. Okay, so let's just go to that's the, the biggest okay. stupid. You have to drag me. <laughs> yes, did you drag me? Are you ready for your big fight? No, I can't move. But we have a plan. I'm gonna swing your punches for you. They're gonna see you. Maybe they won't. We went over this. Come on, let's go. I want to forfeit. <laughs> All right. Already. Nice and clean fight. We're going three rounds, just like I do with my wife every night. What? <laughs> what? I, I don't need to know that. All right, you ready? Okay. Go. I'm about to beat your butt like I did in high school. I'm gonna swing for you. Okay. Oh, wait, I... Hold on, hold on. <laughs> it's cheating. You can't swing for him. I'm his trainer. Uh oh, go ahead, train your ass in the corner, sir. <laughs> no, it's it's okay. cheating. He don't be here there. Are you sure about that? Oh, yeah. All right, then. 2v1, go. Oh, two on one. Oh, oh, boy. Oh, yeah, he's going to hit him. 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 I know, but they ass need it. Come on, let's go think of a plan. Okay. Yeah, good idea. We have to think of a plan. Yeah, no shit. Marvin, I think we should just tell them that I tried to cheat and then reschedule for a time when I can actually use my body. What, you want to tell your high school bully you tried to cheat when fighting him? No, but I also don't want him to beat the ever-loving shit out of me again. No, look, we have to think of a plan because that's embarrassing if you tell him you tried to cheat. Okay, what if you get on top of my head and you control me like Ratatouille, like you pull my hair? Oh, Does yeah, I remember really that movie. That an animated movie. Yeah, you're right. I just have a king for having my hair pulled. Ooh, of course. What if I let him hit you in the face and then while he's hitting you in the face, I start hitting him? Okay, and then we take turns? No, 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 no. He just keeps hitting you in the face because he's not going to see it coming because while he's beating you up, I'll come up from behind him and start hitting him in the head. Okay, you know what? Fine, let's try it. Oh, yeah, we're going to win. Watch this. Uh, All right, and I'm going to count this as round two because your ass lost the first round. That's fair. <laughs> Look, try to put your hands up. Oh, believe me, I wish I could. Listen, man, I feel bad for you. So I'm going to do you a solid. I'm only going to follow you with my left hand. See, see, that's generous. Only the left hand right. is to be one. <laughs> It is generous and all. Oh yeah, there's no way I could lose. Look, look. Are y'all ready? Round two. Go. I call this one my gut punch. Oh. Oh my. Oh my. Oh my. Oh jeez, that's too much. That's too much. Okay. Enough. Enough. And Randy Candy wins. Candy Randy wins. Randy Candy. You seriously? So oh my god, I can't believe you forfeit. We could have won. No, we couldn't. Oh, let's go. Uh, oh, come on, buddy. Marvin, today was very embarrassing. Well, you would have had a it was chance also to humiliating. Win and well, it would have worked if you switched the cups. You never told me to switch the cups. I thought it went without saying. You should have told me to switch the cups. <sighs> Marvin, I hate when we argue. Yeah, me too. Yeah, it sucks when you guys argue. Too. Well, there's one thing we have in common. We both hate Candy Randy. Oh yeah, fucking hate that guy. Yeah, he's the worst. You want to help me take tape off the couch? Sure, just roll me over. I'll do it with my mouth. That's what she said. <laughs> That's a good one. Yeah, so... What? Oh, come yeah, on. Uh, yeah, you gotta roll me over there. Oh. Yeah, yeah. roll him. Uh, yeah, you do. Hey, what do you put all this tape? Wow, I can't believe that tape was still there. <laughs> what is your favorite Bro Brooklyn guy story? I don't know. <laughs> they all sound so disturbing. Oh, this, oh, Candy Randy. It's probably a new character, I believe. It's it's probably it's probably a new character. I have no freaking idea. Oh, all right, video's done with my Moto G light on. So, uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Stay tuned for Gatta Resort. I am still training in progress. Roger's got to go, and I've had enough of him as it is. So yeah, I'll show you later tonight. Stay tuned, and I'll see you.